Well. Hmm. Been a while, folks, huh? Been a couple centuries or decades, probably, huh? Since I did a video. So, what a better time to do a video than to come outside when it's in the 30s. And uh, I'd rather be here now than tonight, though. It's going down to about 8 degrees tonight. Got a little sub zero weather coming in tonight. But then it's going to rain Monday. Can you hard, hard, hard to believe, huh? Can you believe that? Well, I've been on a while. Some stuff has been going on. I produced some sugar diabetes. Uh, I hadn't seen a doctor for almost two years, and I knew something was up. So I says, I better go back to the doctor. And uh, pardon me a minute. Oh, my head and my ears are getting a little chilly. Time to do a little covering up there. A little housekeeping. I'm smoking my mortar pipe with the green stem that Oliver Wood Piper made me over the summer. And then I'm smoking some Scottish Mixter by McBaron. If you ever haven't tried it, give it a try. It's pretty good stuff. We had a bad storm there uh, beginning of the week, you know, and had about a foot and a half of snow. But a lot of it, some of it's melted, and more will be going Monday, which doesn't uh, hurt my feelings at all. Anyway, I, sh I got sugar diabetes. It happened, I hadn't seen a doctor a couple of years. I went to, a, actually, I went to two doctors, didn't like them. They were all over my ass about my weight. I should be about 150 and I'm 180. Well, I was 180, but I finally went to a local doctor. Actually, it's a nurse practitioner and the next thing, best thing to a doctor. She said, well, we ought to order some blood work done on you. And they discovered I had 6.8 AC, AC1, uh, too high sugar content, so uh, they wanted me to take medicine met for them, and I refused to take it. So I went on a diet, and I lost 13 pounds so far. So I was about 180, I'm down to about uh, 167. And uh, I got to keep working on it, though. So, uh, I went to the doctor's Tuesday and she was very happy with the sugar because I had blood work done it after I'd lost weight and it went down to 5.6, which is good. So uh, about 12 point, 12 point drop. So uh, 12 number drop anyway. Should be between 4.8 and 5.9. So. So she's all happy, and she says, I want to see you again in two months. Make sure you're not going back in two months, folks. Sorry. That's ridiculous. I mean, it, I'm doing better now. I'm doing better. I feel better. What do I need to go back in two months? I figure if things are good, I go every six months, you know? So that ain't going to happen. So I got to lose some more weight. I like to get down to about, not going to be right now with the holidays coming, so right after Christmas I like to get down to about 160 and then I'll be happy. But uh, I haven't, like I say, I haven't done a video, but I've been around YouTube watching some videos. And some pipe videos. Uh, last weekend I went on the uh, artist, what's it, artist uh, stuff in, uh, and uh, what's a Piper Skip down there in Texas, I believe. I missed their uh, live stream today, but last weekend I was on there a little bit. Of course, I watch mattresses, but I don't comment or anything Friday nights. And, uh, geez, my hands are getting a little cold here, but oh well. It's been worse. I should have wore a thin pair of gloves, would have been better. 
But uh, I've been getting around watching some videos and and uh, well, I told you I, I'm smoking this mortar pipe that olive wood piper made me. Well, I got two other olive wood pipes I had to make uh, late last spring and over summer too. And uh, I got itchy for another one and I saw he made a bunch of pipes recently. And one of the pipes he made was a walnut one. And I got thinking about it and I said, you know, I got a mortar pipe and I got two olive wood pipes. Uh, and these pipes are reasonable, so that's why I buy them off of them because I can't afford these pipes that these guys make like uh, that one guy, Joe Case. Jeez, I can't afford this. Ridiculous what they get for pipes. 200 more dollars for a pipe. Come on, get the hell out of here, you know. They're not worth it. You know, this pipe's just as, uh, this smoke's just as good as the pipes that they make, for crying out loud. And this mortar pipe, but it cost me like, I don't know, what was it, 75, 80 bucks or whatever, you know. And I love it. It's a good smoker. So I said, I'm going to have, I want to, I want to try walnut. So I text him, I says, hey, and call, and talk to him, I call, uh, he, actually he called me back. And he says, uh, yeah, I, I sold a couple of those pipes, but I got a couple left. I said, well, I hope the one is a walnut. And he says, yep. I says, well, I want it. So, here it is. It came yesterday. And, uh, I'm going to, oh, geez, I hope I can get in this thing. He's got it, he's got it really taped up good. And I don't even know if I'm going to be able to get into it without a knife. Damn. He really packaged them up good. But I'm going to blister this baby open, believe me. I'm not going back in to get a knife. If I have to wreck the box, I'll do it. Ooh, I even bet my pipe tamper. I'm getting into it. But I'm not going back in. And interrupt this video, get a knife, because I go all the way around the front of the house. I'm not doing it. So. So, here we go. Some wrapping in there. And he always sends a card there. Nice little card. And he gave me a little sample of some tobacco there. And a tamper. He gave me a couple samples of tobaccos here. <laughs> Quite a guy. He's a hell of a good guy. This is some Latakia blend. I don't know what that is. And this is, I can't, well, some Perique. He gave me a couple things to do some, uh, maybe some, uh, mixed in, mixing in some tobaccos. I can't even speak, uh, spell this, uh, uh, pronounce this tobacco. But it's some, uh, horse, horse shit, horse. It's, uh, it's a slang, it's horse shit tobacco. <laughs> It's not the real name for it, but it's a, it's, I guess they call it horse shit tobacco, I don't know. I forget what he told me on the phone, but I says, yeah, send me some. I, I don't remember things, I tell you. My mind's shot sometimes. Damn, my hands are getting cold out here. Must be in a, probably, by now it's probably in the upper 20s. It was around 30, 32 before. It's supposed to be dropping as the sun goes down. I hate this winter. God damn it, I hate it. I don't mind so much the, the snow, but I hate the freaking cold. It just rips me apart. I can't do nothing, and, and I just... It's, it's crazy. Of course. Olive wood, Carl's got to always give a, pipe, a tamper. Which I don't think a lot of guys even give me a tamper. Oh man, that's beautiful. 
God damn it. Look at that tamper. Look at that tamper, huh? See, it's olive wood right there. Look at that grain. Beautiful. Ghost Gob calls him. He's got a new name, Pops. Well, Pops did a hell of a good job on that tamper, boy. I want to tell you that. Look at that tamper. Beautiful, isn't it? Beautiful. Look at that. That grain is unbelievable, isn't it? Look at the grain in that tamper. I love that tamper, Carl. That's a great job on that, man. Beautiful. I can't wait to see what the pipe looks like now. You gotta hold on. Gotta relight this pipe, I think. Uh oh. My lighter just went kaput. The last of it. Good thing I got this lit. Oh well. I hope it stays lit until I'm done with the video. Oh well. Now here's the pipe. You get the uh, drums rolling out there, everybody? How about those drums? You got them going? Here we go. You've probably seen it because you already showed the pipe, but I gotta do I gotta do the I gotta do the professional way of doing it. There it is. There it is. Boy, look at that stem. I love that pipe. God, it's beautiful. Walnut. Look at that. God damn, that's a nice pipe. Man, oh man, damn it, it's nice. Sorry for the swearing there a little bit, but it's nice. Look at that stem. Look at that. Look at all those colors. Beautiful, is it? Ah, uh, yeah. Too bad I couldn't smoke food fights so much, huh? Hmm. <laughs> like the stem, too. Feel? Yeah. Great job, Carl. You do a great job no matter what it is. And I love that pipe. God. I'm glad I uh, called them up. I got itchy for another pipe. I think it, it'll even set there. It'll set. It's got a nice taper bow on, bow on it. Uh, bow. It tapes in a little bit. Beautiful job. God, I love it. Damn. Beautiful pipe. Good job, Pops. I think Carl's on vacation to see his brother. He told me he's up in Staten Island this week. I don't know if he's still there or not. He's coming up to visit his brother for a week, I guess. God, that's beautiful. Beautiful job. I love that tamper too. I love that olive wood grain. Damn. The middle's a walnut. Olive wood on the ends. Love it. Now, packaging that back up without my hands falling off. They are getting cold. I can't wait to stick them back in my pocket. Damn. I hate that. I wish I could move, but I wouldn't want to go south because I hate the heat. So I only don't like the cold weather, but I hate the hot weather too, so I guess I bitch no matter what it is like. Some people are never happy, and I guess I'm one of them. As the old saying goes, I gotta get my pudgies warmed a little bit. Damn. Not so bad when my I can handle the cold outside, but it's my pot my hands that get cold. You know. If I had uh 
a pair of uh, those thin knit gloves, which I should have brought outside with me. It would have been okay, but, you know, again, once again, dumb Larry doesn't use his head, you know. I guess when they, uh, when they hand out train, uh, brains, that's what they meant, jump a train, jump on a train, you know. But anyway, so, uh, anyway, Carl, I told Carl that maybe next month I might want another pipe. He told me he makes church wardens. I didn't know that until the last time I talked to him on the phone there last week. Or the be well, beginning of the week. When did I talk to him? Was it Sunday? Yeah, I think it was Sunday. Sunday afternoon he called me. So I might pick a church warden out somewhere that I like and see if he can make it. I think I want to make me like a poker, poker type church warden. I don't know if he'll be able to do it. I'm, I'm sure he'll be able to figure something out. But uh, I got to get some of the snow shoveled out around my table here. I got my fire pit over there. One of these nights I'm going to have a fire. Or maybe in the afternoon late I'll have a fire. I got some firewood over there. I got some firewood I'm going to toke up. And I'm going to have a fire here. Maybe next week or next weekend. Not Monday because it's going to rain Monday. But I got some Rattorondack chairs over there and they're all snowed in over there. So forget about them. Well, I can shovel them out. Like I say, some of the snow is melted, but it's going to be pretty hard to shovel after tonight with the cold temperatures, but I don't know if I show you the snow or not, how much we got, but I'm going to take the camera around here and show you that uh, there's my chairs over there. It's a house in back of me. As you can see, my chairs over there are a little bit plowed in. My backyard, there's my fire pit. I got a shovel out. It'll go over Holly route about right there. Got to shovel all the snow out in here. I got some crap piled up over there. You can see that's how much snow we got over there. That's a uh, Convenience store over there. Only one in town. Convenient gas station store. Over there. And uh, that's part of my umbrella you see on my table there. They got chickens over there. They keep chickens in the back there. What? And over here. That's the post office over there. Right next to my house. Right there, as you can see, there's the main highway over there, over the bank over there. Too much snow right there. So, that's it. All right. I guess I rambled on enough here and wasted part of your after noon or early evening or whatever it is when I get this uh, video up a little to YouTube if I do because I checked all the boxes in there for not being a video for kids but I haven't done it since they made the changes so I might not even be able to upload this video it's all going to be remain to be seen because uh, when I go in and try it I might not be able to do it we'll see if I um, accomplish it or not so Anyway, to the next video. I'll try not to wait till too long the next time. I hope you had a great week. And I hope you're enjoying your weekend. And be safe. And enjoy puffing your pipe. I'm going to catch you in the next video. This is Toymaker Larry. And I'm signing out. Adios.